applying for an FCC, FRN, or federal registration number, may seem complicated and tedious. However, following these steps, will greatly simplify the process. From the website handstudy.org, locate a convenient test session for you. Part of the registration process is securing an FRN, your federal registration number. Unless you already have an FCC call sign, most amateur radio applications will require an FRN. As you register for an exam, you will be asked if you have this number, if not, select, no, here. Be sure to not close the ham study window in your web browser. A new window will appear on your screen, this is now the FCC. You will need a new, unique username, so click on the register button in the center of your screen. Pay close attention to the following fields. Your email address is your username. Enter your username twice followed by a password two times, in the required field, be sure to remember, or write down your password. The second half, of this document, will ask for your phone number. For US phone numbers, and area codes, enter a country code with the digit, 1. Followed by your area code and phone number. This is also the time to select your security question, and answer. It is now time to briefly verify the email address that you provided to the FCC. You will now receive an email from the FCC with an embedded link. Follow this link to verify that the email address you entered is in fact your own. Congratulations, you have now verified your email address. You have now registered for an account only at the FCC. We are not quite done yet. Next we register for a new FRN. Let's start these steps now, by clicking on the blue, Go to Course, button. Most first-time FCC registration users will select the link for Register New FRN. The majority of applicants will be registering as, an individual, unless you are representing a corporation, partnership or government agency. A restricted use, FRN registration is rather uncommon. Most amateur radio applicants are seeking a standard course registration. Select that, here. Pay close attention to the following field, it will serve you well. Be sure to include your social security number. And, paying close attention to the fields which are required. They are indicated with a red asterisk. When complete, click on Submit. Congratulations! You have created an FCC account in course. You have also requested an FRN, and now, your new federal registration number is being displayed on your screen. Copy and save this number right now. It is very important to manage your license later with the FCC. Armed with your newly assigned federal registration number, you are now ready to complete your HAM study registration for your amateur radio exam. Enter your new FRN number on the screen. Once you complete your registration at mstudy.org for your exam, prepare for an email from Exam Tools. That's the online test engine where your exam will be administered from. Keep studying and reach out to your test team with any questions you might have regarding your examination. Your test team is anxious to meet you, administering your examination and seeing you pass with flying colors. Welcome to the HAM family. We are anxious to see your new call sign issued or upgraded and we want to hear you on the air very soon. Stay radioactive and congratulations!